welcome and be sure to hit that notification bell for my new uploaded videos. Today's review will be on this beautiful braided wig from Kales. This is a handmade braided wig. She's a 13 by six Swiss lace frontal with baby hairs. Really nice, loving that 13 by six frontal. She is uh, 28 inches long approximately. She's in a color black. The uh, hair is made from connectolin fibers. Well constructed. Cap is very comfortable. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in and detail uh, my uh, braids a little bit more because I want those uh, braids on that 13 by six uh, frontal to lay a little bit flatter for me, okay? And I did find out later, I was doing this on camera, but uh, I found out that it was much easier for me to go in and uh, sew those braids down off camera, off of the mannequin's head. But you get the concept of what I'm talking about, okay? I wanted to lay that a little bit flatter because they was just a little bit too poofy for me. But you can wear her just like this straight out of the package and you don't have to do any detailing at all. The detailing is up to you. Now she's laying much flatter for me. Yeah, really, really beautiful wig, okay? Listen, my commentary is coming up next. Hi guys, and welcome to my YouTube channel. I hope that something is said or you've seen something that you like and you will come back again. But listen, I have on this beautiful wig from Coless. That's the company's name, Coless. All the information I'll have down in the description box. Now I showed you what the wig looked like in the beginning of the video. Uh, this is her after I have tweezed the baby hairs added my favorite uh, powder to the parting area, which it looks like this is coming out of my scalp, right? This does not look like a wig. I showed you some clips where I was sewing the hair down to make it flat on each side. You don't have to do that. You can wear your wig just like it is out of the packaging. But for this look, that's what I wanted to do. Now let me turn around and do a 360 for you, let you see the back of it. This is the length on her, really nice length. Pretty good uh, coverage. Saw some reviews on this unit and uh, some reviewers said that it was not big head friendly. Well, it was too big for me. I have a little pea head, little bitty pea head, right? And I don't have a lot of hair. So the cap was a little bit too big for me. So it's according to your head size and how much hair that you have, how this cap is going to fit you, okay? As you see, it's by it being laying flat to my head, this looks simply amazing, right? It looks just like I just got my hair braided. It does not even look like a wig. And that is because of the alterations that I did. Now you don't have to do all those alterations, but the thing about it, when you get a wig, you need to make a wig your own. And so that's what I wanted to do. Now I'm loving this 13 by six frontal on here. Really nice, right? I mean, very, 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 very realistic. I'm gonna get up closer and closer, let you see how realistic that this looks. Now, if you have a braided wig collection, definitely add this one uh, to it. If you don't have a wig collection, this is a great starter wig, okay, for you guys. Under $200, and that's a good price as well. Now, I showed you the cap construction in the beginning of the video. You're gonna have the comb in the back, uh, two combs at the top where that 13 by six is, and the elastic band, okay? Now I did use an edge control to lay down uh, my baby hairs that I tweezed 
came out pretty good. But after that, I did spray the front of my perimeter with some of my got to be glue, just to make sure that it laid down and melted in more. Guys, definitely jump on this one because of the naturalness, the realisticness, the ease of applying uh, this unit. Yeah, so all the information on uh, where you can find this one is going to be down in my description box. Okay, thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.